let us uh, revise if f steel beam gets concentrated load what are the sex we will have to do so that our section is good so here i showed a beam um, yes i i showed a beam I mean, oh, it's not working i showed a beam here it has a concentrated load at the mid span roughly and support reaction so here i have three concentrated load three concentrated load why three one is here one is this support reaction and this uh, one is the support reaction here so if there is a concentrated load in a beam we have to do six six one is wave building that means if the wave here is good to take this load or the wave here is good to take this load or wave here is good to take this load same thing for wave crippling so you have to check wave crippling and then uh, wave side sway buckling so that the wave doesn't buckle sideways so this six this three six okay so these three six are for a uh, wave then other three six uh, here so one is plate bearing and plate bending that means whatever plate we are using here is called bearing plate another plate here another plate here this plate is good for bending or bearing or no we have to check it other check it support crashing support crashing that means if this support is good or this support is good or no now you can see here uh, here and here we have to do all the six six here we have to do um, all the six except the support creation because there is no support here so support will go here and support will go here not here so these are the six six we will have to do it uh, something else that uh, there is a shortcut actually, it's, it, actually it is not shortcut and uh, that means if we provide a plate here if we provide a plate here that is called a uh, bearing stiffener if we provide plate here so here if we provide plate that is called bearing stiffener if we provide plate then we do not need to check for wave building uh, wave crippling and wave side sway buckling but the other three we will have to check depending on the uh, location support uh, support we have to do it here and uh, sorry support we have to do it here and here but if we provide a bearing stiffener we do not need to check the wave yielding crippling and wave side sway buckling okay now let us see how to do wave side sway buckling because this is not covered in our earlier videos so in your book here these are the two conditions or two condition which will let us uh, check the uh, wave side say buckling number one if my flange is no is restrained against rotation that means if my planes cannot rotate that means if my deck is tightly connected with planes so that it cannot rotate then this is our uh, capacity equation for if it is less than or equal equal to 2.3 if it is more than 2.3 we do not need to say that is good enough if my flange is not if my flange is not restrained against rotation then for this condition my capacity is this this condition do we do not need to check now whatever our case is flange is restrained or not so we know what to do either this equation or this equation we have to use to find our capacity now most of the parameters are available from ASC manual uh, he, what is ace ace is the depth of the wave tw is the wave thickness l l is something new here it is the unbraced length unbraced length laterally unsupported unbraced length bf is the uh, wave or oh, if i if i go to my next page it clearly tells all the parameters so here l largest unbraced length along either top or bottom place at the load point that is whatever the unbraced length is the largest one okay so we will so we will see here so all the other parameters are known from aic manual so hopefully you you saw how to use um, uh, how to use this equation to check the wave side sway uh, crippling uh, other good news is that for concentrated load most of the cases or all of the cases we use bearing stiffener if we use bearing stiffener uh, then we do not need to check for wave yielding, wave crippling, and wave side sway building. What is uh, bearing stiffener? A plate we inserted here, 
that means wherever there is a concentrated load we insert a plate and that takes care of the wave uh, problem okay so there is no example for uh, there is no example here uh, how to how to check for uh, wave type shape buckling so hopefully you, you got the idea how to do it uh, we will stop here in our next video we will see how to design uh, the bearing uh, stiffener thank you